What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to use Ibis Paint X on your Windows PC or Mac. To use Ibis Paint X on your PC, you must use an Android emulator such as Bluestacks. Click on the first link in the description to access this page. From here, download the Bluestacks 5 setup installer for your system. This should take a second to complete and you can follow the install wizard to install the application to your system. After the installation is complete, Bluestacks should open up automatically. Next, open the Play Store and ensure you're logged in with your Google account. Search for Ibis Paint X and download the game to your Bluestacks emulator. Depending on a network connection, this might take a few minutes to complete. While downloading the game, you should take a look at your emulator settings. Click on this gear icon to access these settings. In the Performance tab, you should set these according to your PC's performance. For users with 4GB or less RAM, set the memory allocation to Basic. Under Performance mode, make sure to set this option to Balanced. This will reduce the memory and CPU usage if your PC lags or you otherwise encounter low performance. I prefer to enable the High FPS option and set the frame rate of the emulator according to my screen refresh rate. If you need more clarification on your refresh rate, right-click your desktop and select Display Settings. From here, make sure that the correct display is selected. Scroll down and click on Advanced Display. This will allow you to preview your refresh rate and change it. Back on the Display Settings page, set the display orientation to Landscape and choose a fitting resolution to play Ibis Paint X on your monitor. If you want to troubleshoot performance issues, Enable the Display FPS during gameplay option in the Bluestack settings. You can leave the other settings to the default option and play Ibis Paint X to see how well it runs on your PC. After launching the game, head to your in-game settings by clicking on the cog icon at the top right corner. This will open a settings window from where you can scroll down and find options such as gesture settings, game UI controls and other paint related settings such as layer row height, Tool select position, background color and more to tweak to your preferences. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.